Yo, let's read between these bars. You better grab you better grab everything you got right now, homie. Pack up one. It's about to get crazy. Oh shit. Here we go again. This isn't the ad. I just wanted to shout out the best community created by the, the dopest duo behind Thought Crime. Prince Solomon and Sincere Ignorance. Esoteric knowledge, hip hop news. They, they cover everything. There's too much to talk about. They support me, so let's support the homies. They're bumping my music. Hopefully, they're still bumping it right now. <laughs> Everybody in the Discord is theorizing. You can only get to the Discord if you sign up to the Patreon, though. Shout out to the homie Kiki. They're theorizing. It, they ain't theories no more. Shit is coming coming to fruition. That's what I'm saying. You got to sign up for that shit. I wanted to cover these album covers in these colors. The last time Tyler did a like a heavy theme like this was the bowl cut on Igor. If y'all remember that. But you remember how heavily love was the focus of the album? Keep the theme of love in mind. Look at the color wheel. Pink, right? Green is the inverse of pink. You see how the title and credits of the album is laid out? Maybe pay attention to the layout. We got a green title. We got green title cards. If you saw the promo videos and the vinyls, he's wearing a green suit. You can mean a lot of things in a lot of different cultures, but you see the horns. You, see, you know what we're going through now with all of this death and decay, right? But the inverse of love is hate. And once you get to hate, that's when the destruction begins. Tyler is going to be straight ushering in a new era of destruction. Rebuilding and blowing up all of this shit and exposing and... I think Tyler's gonna be on his exposure type shit too. Think about the pilot uniform though. Think about when his album's releasing. He's the first one out of the people that's associated with Kendrick, you know what I'm saying? Not to pop out. That's able to do this artsy kind of shit. First off, this promo video audio is loud as hell for no reason. Like it's overbearingly loud. And I think that's on purpose. And it also sounds like you're in a lullaby. Which is right, he's dancing the way he's dancing all slow and shit. Also the sepia tones and how everything is colored a certain way the color grading in this whole shit is crazy but as soon as the picture falls off the wall it's chaos the music goes different you're woken up out of the dream almost and you see him start dancing a whole different kind and of you're way. snapped out of the lullaby back into reality and now he's stepping he's got your attention until he bumps back into the vinyl and now it's peace again you're back into the lullaby there's some there's some symbolism there when you try to speak out and you try to say a message, but then you're put back into your place. You try to speak out and say a message, you're put back into your place. Interesting. This whole little promo. There's so many other little deep hidden messages I, hadn't, I haven't even found. Cross my heart and hope to die, though. You see that, right? The most interesting thing about this whole sequence is the fact that he goes to get people out of the line from being blown up. He specifically grabs a group. Kiki W broke this down. I'm bringing you a piece of it. Thought Crimes Discord, go to it. This is the only piece I'm giving. The movements are similar to Joker in The Dark Knight. He goes through everybody's papers, annoyingly so, but almost as if like it's not a problem, until he gets a little Yachty's papers. He double T, looks at it twice. He looks at him, he's like, what the fuck? And throws it at him with no respect. It's almost as if like, motherfucker, you're not even supposed to be here, but we're gonna take care of you anyway. Get your stupid ass over here. I guess you're part of it too. Then he goes to this. This is the most Joker thing ever. Boom, ushering in the destruction. This is the beginning. This is literally part one, because Kiki is still dropping all kinds of theories and everything. If y'all want more, let me know. It don't even matter, really. It don't matter. I'm just waiting for Kiki to put the rest of it in the order so I can actually break it all down. Did a whole breakdown of Noid too, compared it to the G. It don't even matter. Y'all gonna get that. Y'all gonna get that soon. Kiki, salute. Doc Crime Army, salute. I'll see you on the next one. Love. All credit to Kiki and everybody in the Thought Crimes Discord. Don't get it twisted.